they're saying that it was a cover-up. Like, they cover, they staged the shootout, which is why they're going to call it premeditated. If it was just a shooting and, and that's all it would be, he would just get he would just get charged with first-degree murder. But because he, like, conspi like it supposedly he's conspired a whole, like, cover-up, they're going to drop the premeditated on him, which is worse. It's crazy. Um, like, he planned it. And, mm. like I said, no, no one knows what happened, but... Yeah. Yeah, yeah. A, a lot of the things people say, though, which is crazy to me, right? The whole Illuminati conspiracy theory, right? Recently, we had YNW Melly um, recently uh, arrested and accused of a double murder of his actual, you know, close friends, which is a crazy situation, right? Um, the story basically is, you know, they have cell phone records that say, you know, his phone was with their phone. Um, you have witness stories not matching up, forensic evidence. But what you don't have is a video. You don't have a gun and you don't have a motive, right? So this situation to me, it gets crazier and crazier by the day. Um, can you, like, just if you're, from your point of view, like, when you first heard of the situation, what did you think about it? I mean, I remember when it happened, like, when they died. I remember all that. It was really sad. Um, that's just a sad story for anybody to go through at a young age. But now, it's just crazy. Like, I don't, I don't know. It's crazy because of how, if he did do it, how well he was, he played everybody around. I don't like personally know him, but I know people who personally know him and have like told me like how he was acting when it did happen. And he's a really good actor, if that's the case. Mm. But I mean, I mean, my baby daddy was in jail. Was like, you don't know what they did to deserve it. So I mean, like niggas in the streets, like I don't know. I, nobody's like canceling him though. That's one thing about it. like, I mean, and the thing about it is he's so talented. He was super talented. Mm -hmm. Like he was an artist. I was really, really excited about. And it's just like, damn. <laughs> right, right, like right on his. I don't know his... why these little boys be getting himself into so much goddamn trouble. Like, by I me, mean, hey, he told everybody he was a murderer, and I, you know, he, he. He spoke his truth. He, he was about his word. <laughs> Man, it's like art imitates reality, you know? That's that's what they always say. Um, and it's just so crazy that a lot of his music has to do with this type of situation, right? Yeah, which was not surprising. You it know? wasn't surprising. I mean, it's, it's only surprising because those were his close friends. But then again, I don't know what happened. I mean, it ha like you said, it happens every... People get shot every day, B. But, like... The, the way it happened and the way it played out, a lot of the stuff still was crazy to me. For them to charge you with first degree premeditated murder, they have to have a motive, number one, right? What is the motive? You know what I mean? So it's a lot of gaps into it. It's a lot of things that don't make sense. But a lot of times when things are extra well, crazy. premeditated murder doesn't necessarily mean it's a, a, a motive. It just means that you were planning it. It doesn't necessarily mean it's a motive. So like they're saying that it was a cover up. Like they, cover, they staged the shootout, which is why they're gonna call it premeditated. If it was just a shooting and, and that's all it would be, he would just get he would just get charged with first degree murder. But because he like conspired, like, it supposedly he's conspired a whole like cover up. That's they're gonna drop the premeditated on him, which is worse. It's crazy. Um, like he planned it, and mm. like I said, no, no one knows what happened, but yeah, yeah, yeah. A, a lot of the things people say though, which is crazy to me, right? The whole Illuminati conspiracy theory, right? I don't believe that. I don't believe that had anything to do with it. He was just a little street nigga, and he killed people, and he talked about it. And you fucked up. I mean, one thing is, if you're going to commit crimes, don't rap about it. They be rapping about it like the, like the feds going to be listening. <laughs> like, I mean, come on. We should have learned from Bobby Shmurda, right? That's number one. Then we should have learned from uh, Rallo. That's number two. Then we should have learned from A.R. Ab, number three, Boozy. Like, I could keep going. See Murder. Like, there's so many people in the most recent 6 9 Like, we should learn from all these people. Make your music as true as possible, y'all. But if y'all really, really still out here about that life, just, just cut it out. You know what I mean? Talk about flowers and birds or some shit. You know what I mean? <laughs>